to Super Reaction Bros. I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we are taking a look at the official theme song trailer for Final Fantasy VII Remake. Yes, they released a trailer. I feel like it's kind of a Dear John-ish letter, considering the game has been delayed from March 3rd to April 10th. So, it's sad, but you know what? It's still, you know, it's still coming out this year. It's still, it's only a few weeks, a few weeks kind of delay. Plus, there's still a whole bunch of stuff to do in March. Let's be honest. March is fucking stacked with movies, TV, oh, movies, video games, all the like, pretty much. So, you're all set for March. So, delay it. I mean, the only downside is it's one week after Resident Evil 3 Remake, which for me is like, it's like, I don't know how long I'm going to be on Resident Evil 3 Remake. Cause and it's, Resident delayed, it's also after, was it, they really spawn as well? Which gives people oh, no, that's, yeah, that's March, well. yeah, that's March as well. So, you know, like, it gives people to play spawn for a little bit, you know? It's so, like, it's kind of weird because you really want to play all these games, but you're like, I got to choose wisely what I, what I play with or my, uh, equalize my time. So, one thing I do know from this trailer is we are getting legit whole lot more new footage considering the game awards didn't exactly give us a whole lot more new There's footage a lot of repeat this footage. a little snippets of new footage throughout this yeah. is full on more new footage also it's official theme song trailer so i guess the official theme song to final fantasy 7 remake will be a part of this trailer as well so, so let's take a look at this for final fantasy 7 remake the official theme song trailer so here we go So, what did you want to talk about? Once oh. Spring comes, I'm leaving town. I'm going to McDonald's. I'm going to be a soldier. The best of the best. Like Sephiroth. Like when Sephiroth was an asshole. Oh! It's a piece of Genova. Sephiroth. Tell me. Is it really you? I am asking you to reconsider. No, begging. Director to us, The stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. Lots of supersaturation confirmed. Engaging materia cooling to reduce temperature. Ugh. And then, director, you have a meeting shortly. Stop. Your timing is impeccably atrocious. Really? Oh, dear. A man of my refined taste. Running out of butter. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. That guy looks like such a weasel. Welcome to the Humvee Inn. Well, oh my god. The, the fucking club. The oh god. Him dressing him as a chick. Yeah. Wolf. Wow. Not even one? No. But you're so pretty. Yeah, Doc, I'll get new footage. Jeez. That's a new I know that's a new character. A second day. Just the two of us. New one they're introducing. Yeah. Rich 13! I am that what you see before you. Nothing more. Wow. Yeah, that part is definitely near the end of the part one. Touching ring. Oh. God damn it, this fucking scientist. You will continue not to disappoint us. Son of a bitch. <laughs> wow, they're li that's the end. Oh shit. Yeah, this definitely looks like near the end of part one. All oh, Leviathan! It's Leviathan 7, cool! Oh, Shinra HQ. Oh, there's a joke about summon! Holy shit! That's cool! Damn. <laughs> 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 
fuck I, I, me. I can see why Max's reaction is like losing his shit. Yeah. The Shinra Electric Power Company isn't the real enemy. I promise you, there's a much bigger threat. I just want to do everything in my power to help all of you. This is going to be a lot of part one. Yeah, they pretty much just... Grand, jam packing part one. Wait. Uh Okay, April. Okay. The sad news. Um, yeah, the sad, okay, the sad, sad news, news for a lot of fans. One, okay, obvious it replay it quietly, but I can guarantee what they showed was literally like, if they if they're considering the Final Fantasy VII remake like a full game, mm -hmm. they pretty much just showed the third act. They just pretty much showed the third act of the game. Pretty much. Like the final part of it. Them infiltrating Shinner HQ. It appears them trying to escape from Midgar. From the looks of it. all Like Red 13 even shows up near the end. Of uh, it, well, when they infiltrate Shinner HQ. Yeah. This guy. Uh, the guy with the goatee. And the guy saying like. You know we shouldn't be doing this. Like that. That, guy's, that guy's vital in future parts of the game. I'm, I guess I won't spoil it here. Because for one thing. I don't exactly remember. Like the details, the, of it. the full details. I know the creepy scientist dude they showed. He's a complete asshole. He's all more about his research and shit like that. All that shit. Like one of the main reasons they're even infiltrating Shinra is because they actually uh, take uh, Aerith, pretty much. Um, him dressing up as a chick. That's, yeah, that's actually. That's from they. They've said that for the moment they showed brand new footage. Like yes, the cross dressing segment is it's in, still in the game. Yeah. In the game. And I remember in the original. Well, I remember watching the original. They do say like, if you get all the right accessories, every single piece of Cloud's outfit, Don the Don will choose Cloud, because you could choose any of you three. Uh, you, Aerith, or um, Tifa. It's a, it's a matter if you choose the right, perfect. Uh, yeah, yeah. If you get every single piece, I believe one of the requirements is you have to get every single one piece of the outfits and stuff like that in order for the. And the Honey Bee Club. Oh, good lord. The Honey Bee Club is going to be very interesting mm -hmm. from what I've seen of it. Red 13 looks fucking great, man. Oh, my God. And his story, which sadly won't probably be tackled until, like, part two. Yeah. It's so hard. It's, like, heartbreaking and heartwarming. It's, like, very heartbreaking, too, why he's the... Because they explain more in, like... In detail. When, when he go more into the outer world, pretty much. Why everything... Yeah, and that like I, said, I, forgot, I look up the science. I think it's Ho His name's Hojo, but no, it looks good. Like I said, I mean, it's right now. <laughs> believe it or not, I've been playing the the Final Fantasy. Oh, wait, Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. Um, I think it was it. Oh, I don't know. I don't even remember the one where they're driving the car. I forgot the the number of that one. For which one? The one where they drive the car. The one of because they, they 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 actually drive a vehicle, actual drive an actual car. For, for wherever they have to go to. Oh, Final Fantasy XV? Yeah, I'm playing that one. <laughs> I'm currently playing that one. It's just... It's just yeah, kind of Hojo. Fun. It's but. just me trying to get back into a game like this. You know, the, the, the fighting style in a way. I know it's going to be different, but still, it's like me getting used to it because I'm so used to, uh, you know, playing my other type of game. So it's like getting back into Final yeah. Fantasy because I even like how... Um, the start of Final Fantasy XV, when it, it, the opening the actual title itself says... This is, you know, this is made. This is this is what made for Final Fantasy fans and first timers. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm seeing why, and I'm like, just getting back into this. It, it told me it's getting me prepared for this. Yeah. Okay. Well, uh, yeah. Well, disclaimer: We already brought it up. We haven't. We've never really played Final Fantasy VII. We. I know enough based off of less plays I've seen, based off of like retrospectives I've, played, I've seen for the I've game. I played. I think through half of the game, and that was it. You played through half. Uh, so you played, played more. You played more I than I, played, I, I think. Played. I played half of the game, and that was it. I think I stopped after that. But but, uh, but even then, it was like I, I think hell. Was, that really cool fight. Like we could see one of the first uh, pieces of Genova boss fights, which is ridiculous. It looks like, bonkers. It looks like it's gonna be really crazy. But uh, they, I can see why a lot of people are flipping out over this compared to even the um, the uh, game awards because, like you said, this is showing like. A whole oh yeah, this everything, every piece of this you're seeing is all brand new. Oh yeah, footage. easily you can say this footage is like an apology letter to fans who you know are kind of sad. Awards. Oh no, who are sad the game got delayed. You that's know, true. yeah, yeah. True. So, but yeah, we'll be of course we'll we'll, we'll get our hands on it and we'll try our hands on it down the road. 
if I get to Resident Evil 3 quick enough, but... If I can get through Final Fantasy 15 right now, because I'm still taking my very sweet that, time. That's going to take a very long-ass sweet time, so... Yeah. Other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share around. And if you like us just a little bit more than anybody else, when it comes to talking about video games, and correcting us in the comments below about any, any action to the Final Fantasy 7 remake that we made... Or he made... Hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys' thoughts are on this new trailer. Um, uh, are you excited that they showed like this for all this new footage? You know, what segments are you most excited for? Is it the cross dressing scene, or is it any other sections where it's introduce maybe introduce a new character, or maybe they're um, you know was the that red uh, I'm sorry I'm half asleep. Still. Red thirteen. Red thirteen. Uh, and you know, I mean, is there anything else from there, or are there, are there any other parts you're waiting for that you can't wait to see itself? Um, yeah, just let us know in the comments down below. Put down your thoughts on pretty much the the game delay. Again, we, we he apologizes for any inaccuracies. Maybe he he uh, maybe slipped up on because um, he's the one who did all the talking for this. Uh, but I mean, um, but even if he didn't make any inaccuracies, were is there anything else that we maybe? did not see or missed out on that you could probably bring up to us that maybe it would probably put a smile on his face or maybe just be like, oh, okay. Uh, so let us know in the comments down below, down below and uh, thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. It's been a very Final Fantasy 7 Phil episode, SRB. See ya. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out any of our previous reactions, as well as our other shows, click the playlist down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can check us out on Twitter, as well as Stardust, at Super React Bros.